Hello guys, welcome to my channel, it's Shakira Alexis here and today we've got a review on the Nike Sakai Aldi Waffle Sneaker Collaboration. Um, I've seen a few reviews on this on YouTube but I've not really seen any styling um, for girls especially so I thought I should bring it to you guys today. Um, I absolutely love this shoe, I've obviously not had a chance to wear it out yet due to this lockdown quarantine situation that's going on right now. But um i will be inserting a few clips on how i style this shoe i love the nylon on the toe box um which is different from the other pair because the other pair had mesh um which is just super nice as well like all these different textures and the materials allows you to kind of style it with um products that have again similar um materials so let's get straight into it i have tried and walked in these trainers just now outside um, but I would definitely rate these like easily uh, 8 out of 10 for comfortability. Especially how they look as well. They're super narrow so it doesn't make your feet look too broad. It's just not, it's not cute. So, you know, with the laces, um, the previous Sakai's, the first release that came out, they had um, double lace as well. And these are double lace. They have ribbon and then like a, a slim lace. Um, there as well and then I've also got the gold accent on the tips of the laces which is super nice as well um, again and that kind of helps you style and like what you want to wear with this shoe or jewellery per se um, you can wear gold and just slightly um, complement the shoe with that as well so I will be inserting some clips on how I style this shoe um, so stay tuned for that as well so yeah you guys enjoyed the review and styling video and how i styled the Sakai's please give it a thumbs up and subscribe um i'll be coming out with new content every two weeks so make sure you stay tuned for that um please follow my instagram at mellow.e double s and my brand's instagram at shakira alexis i'll have everything linked below um i'll also probably on the screen put where i got my items from or maybe in the description box whichever's easier um but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video and stay tuned for my next one bye